everybody, it's me, Ota, and I'm gonna be doing an integral battle today! So this integral battle it was requested by Pepper Red Ben, and I'm also gonna be his guest speaker today. And don't forget to subscribe to me, Pepper Red Ben, and me, me, meow! I also got a movie. Alright, so let's, let's do, do this integral battle today. Right here, right now! The first integral is the integral of cosine of 2x over the sine of x plus cosine of x versus the integral of cosine square of x over the sine of x plus cosine of x dx. And this one is actually simpler, so I'm going to be doing this one first. Alright, so let's do this integral battle now. Everybody, this is the first integral, the integral of cosine of 2x over the sine of x plus cosine of x. To do this integral, we have to, we have to be smart. And in case you didn't know, this integral actually simplifies nicely. First, let's us use an, an identity. And we're going to rewrite cosine of 2x as uh, cosine squared of x minus sine squared of x over sine of x plus cosine of x. I'm just going to factor this out to become cosine of x plus sine of x. Cosine of x minus sine of x using difference of squares. All we can do now is that we can cancel these out. And thus, we can simplify this to the integral of cosine of x minus sine of x dx. Now, this is just a baby integral. We know how to do this integral. It's sine of x plus the cosine of x and plus c. This is our first integral. The second integral requires more thinking and requires the harmonic addition theorem. So let us do this. Second Alright everybody, this is the second integral. The integral of cosine squared over the sine of x plus cosine of x. Well, this one is not that easy, but all we need to do is just rewrite it. Okay, to solve this integral, I'm gonna use the identity half 1 plus cosine of 2x over sine of x plus cosine of x dx. I'm going to bring out the half and I'm just going to keep the integral. And this. And now I'm going to split this up to become 1 over sine of x plus cosine of x plus... Oh, sorry. I'm also going to separate this into two integrals. Integral this like this. And then I'm just going to add a bracket. And then I'm going to also add... I'm also going to add the integral of cosine of 2x over sine of x plus cosine of x dx. And guess what? This integral is what we've done just previously. So, now all we have to do is just solve for this integral. This integral, in fact, in case you didn't know, we could use the harmonic addition theorem to rewrite sine of x plus cosine of x. In fact, this is equal to capital A cosine x plus alpha. And to solve for A and well, capital A and alpha, all I need to do is just know that alpha squared equals to this coefficient plus this coefficient with this coefficient squared plus the next coefficient squared equals to 2. Then you just solve for A, which is the square root of 2. Next is the tangent of alpha is equals to the negative coefficient over coefficients. The first coefficient over the second coefficient. Tangent of alpha is equal to negative 1 over 1, which is equal to negative 1. Alpha is thus equal to sorry, negative pi over 4. So, let us just plug in the values. So, we get the integral of 1 over the square root of 2 multiplied by the cosine of x minus pi over 4 dx. And don't forget to add this integral, which you just calculated, is sine of x plus cosine of x. 
But I'm not gonna put any C down yet because I'm just gonna calculate this integral first. To calculate this integral, all we have to do is just um, bring out the coefficient and actually solve for the integral. And you end. I'm just gonna use a u sub with x minus pi over 4. Then du would be equal to dx. And thus, this u sub is just easy. There's no extra coefficients. So we get half multiplied by um, 1 over the square root of 2. The integral of secant of u, in fact, is equal to the natural log of the absolute value of secant of u plus the tangent of u and absolute value. And I'm just going to add the sine of x plus cosine of x. Now we have to replace u with what we always had. And in fact, I'm just going to simplify it now. I'm just going to plus c. And you are done the whole integral. Well, how do you think of both integrals? Well, one of them is easy and one of them not so much but yet yeah, still this is this is still the integral um, this is the end of this video i hope you liked this video um please subscribe to me black pen red pen and me me meow and i hope to see you next time bye everybody